I've so I've done that, but only on sugar daddy dates. Like mm. I've had a couple sugar daddies, and like oh. you've yeah. had sugar daddies. Let's let's talk a bit about this. Yeah. But so you <laughs> go on. You've you've done that a few times. Yeah. Like um, I just had one recently, actually. Um, like a it was like wait, don't you have a boyfriend? Well, it was before we started oh, before dating. Before we very recent. Okay. It was like a couple months ago, and um. And I met him on Tinder, and then I was like, yeah, I'm only doing a sugar daddy, though. I only want a sugar daddy. And he's like, okay, like, and I was like, okay, pay me this much to take me out to, like, dinner. I was like. <laughs> what? <Okay>. Yeah. <laughs> the perks. The so, perks. So, yeah. So, I was like, oh, $400 for dinner. And he called me on the phone. We talked. He liked my personality. And he's like, okay, well, I'm, I've never done this before, but you're super beautiful. Like, I wanted to do it. Like, I really want to get to know you. Like. So how about $200 for lunch? So I was like, okay, bet. So I was like, free meal at a really nice place, and he's paying me. So then, go ahead. Oh, so, and that was your first interact, the first date was the lunch date. Yeah. And, and then. You, so you asked for 200 Yeah. And then I assume he paid for Yeah, lunch. he paid for it. And you want to know something funny? My boyfriend now is actually <laughs> came with me with a few of my coworkers. <laughs> And sat at like two tables away to watch and make sure that like I was safe. <laughs> it's a good <laughs> What? <laughs> it's a huh? true story. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> so But you, they weren't eating with you at the no, table. No, no, they, they were, were like, just across yeah. watching. How many, okay. your boy, your okay, so I'll boyfriend tell you. and like a couple friends. Okay, so me, so I go in before them oh God. and then me and him are talking and everything and you know, it's going good. We're eating, getting a couple drinks with a sugar daddy. And then, um, my, he wasn't my boyfriend then, but my boyfriend now, um, you're friends. You guys, yeah, we were other. friends and sure. we we're coworkers. We had hooked up a couple times, but it wasn't anything, you know? Sure. And then two of my coworkers go and I see them sit at a table, like two tables diagonally from the diagonally from me. And I can make eye contact with my boyfriend and like, and I like just kept a straight face and just, we continued the date and um and then afterward the sugar daddy like slid me like two hundred dollars was like i really <laughs> liked you like let's do this again and then i was like yeah sure and then i was like he said oh do you need a ride i was like no i have someone coming to pick me up i just waited till he left and then i went and went back yeah i have so many questions <laughs> first question how old was the the guy 40. 40 and you met on tinder yes okay 40 years old you met on tinder and remind me you're 20 20 20 what happened to the age gap thing <laughs> <laughs> no i i Hold did on. not well okay okay so like i did not i literally just wanted to make extra money like i did not like there's nothing physical like i was not planning on doing anything physical mm -hmm. he was paying me per day so i just went on a few dates with him and yeah just More got like a couple That's yeah like hanging right. out yeah like, like literally hanging right, out sure. got a few nice dinners i was like yeah like i want to go eat a nice dinner like sure you can take me out on a date okay so then did you how many other times did you see him just i only saw him twice twice and yeah. then the second date he also paid you 200 he paid me yeah he paid me 150 the 100, second time why why the downgrade we were gonna <laughs> what we, <do> okay <laughs> so we were gonna come up with an agreement that was like 1200 dollars a month for eight dates and then he was gonna pay me per date till it reached eight dates okay yeah and so why didn't you continue with that it just you well, didn't, you well, didn't I, like it or i, I it, he was like too much he was like in love with me right off the bat he was like do you want to have kids like i eventually want you to be my girlfriend i want you to be more trusting with me i want to kick this off like i want a relationship with you and it was just like really mentally taxing and then um and then me and my boyfriend started to get more serious and i i it was just too emotionally taxing i couldn't mm -hmm. do it anymore and i just also felt guilty because i felt like i was like lying to him you know finessing him yeah for, for the money and i felt guilty <laughs> Huh. Okay. So only two times, and it was just lunch. L uh, just lunch. lunch and one dinner. One dinner. Okay. But so c kind of a foodie call, yeah. and it's kind of sugar baby situation. But mm -hmm. you didn't really give him any sugar. Nope. No sugar. Nope. No sugar was given. No sugar received. Nope. Just company. I honestly, I don't. I don't get that dynamic at all. 
was he like kind of socially awkward? Was no, he unattractive? He, wasn't. he was. He, he actually was. He, it's not. He actually wasn't that unattractive. I just wasn't attracted to him because the age gap. Mm-hmm. And he was actually really nice and really sweet. And we actually like really had a lot in common. Mm-hmm. Um, and it was just that like, from my perspective, I think he was forty. I don't think he's had a serious relationship. He's like grasping for a wife or something. Wait, he's never had a serious relationship. He told you that? I don't think so. That's crazy. And that's a little trippy. You don't think? He didn't tell you about his past well, relationship yeah, history? Or? Well, he's never had a wife. He told me he said, I've never had a wife. I've never had kids. I've always been super focused on my career. So Was he very wealthy? Very wealthy. He had a Can Bentley. Do you know he had a Bentley? Yeah. Did he ever tell you how much money he made like per year? No, but he told me he's the president of a financial company. Don't, don't say the company, but I don't. I'm not going to say the company. Pre- okay, so he's probably. I he's mean, a C-suite, so he's probably of a six company figures. which does things in over 47 different like country or not countries, uh, states. Okay, interesting. Yeah. Very interesting. Yeah. Ha- have you ever had any other sugar daddy? I have actually. How many sugar daddy well, situations? I, I actually, when I was a freshman, was it freshman in college? No, I was a sophomore. So, um, I just would go on like these dating apps and be like, Hey, like I'm a broke college student. I need some help. Would you mind sending me a money, like money to help pay for tuition? And this guy sent me a hundred bucks. And then, so he's like, Hey, I want to take you on a sushi date. Like I want to help you out. So I went on one sushi date with him and then, um, he paid me a hundred dollars after and was like, Hey, if you ever want to go shopping, if you ever need anything, like let me know and then so every once in a while I'll be like hey like I need money for bills can you send me money he'd send me two hundred dollars here three hundred there and then actually beginning of this beginning of last year like I didn't talk to him for six months I was like hey I need money for dinner like can I have some money we didn't talk for six months he was like oh I don't have Venmo or anything I'll leave you cash like under my mat so I went and picked up 80 bucks he gave me like some money (laughs) and you never hooked up with him oh I went on one sushi date for him and I didn't that was it. I met him once. Okay, so no sugar. No and then sugar. it sounded like there were a couple more maybe. But so and these were all on Tinder. One was on this one app called Meet Me. S- oh, seeking arrangements? I have done that before, but I, I w- that's too sketchy honestly. Okay. Cuz yeah. that is like the if you want an arrangement, that's where you Yeah, that's you like people expect sugar. But so you were so you were just on Tinder, but it sounded like with at least one of them you w- was it on your profile or in your bio that you were l- trying no, to set this arrangement not at up? at all. So, like... You would just message them... Yeah, there would be... Like, and be like, like, I want money. No, no. It would be like... So, like, I'll give you an example. The last yeah, one... Sure. The last one, his name... I'm not going to say his name, but... We're going to call him T. <laughs> so, T messages me. He was like... Tyrone? Um, <laughs> <laughs> Can we call... We'll call him Tyrone. Okay, Tyrone. So, Tyrone messages me. He's like, hey, you're super beautiful. Like... And I was just started talking to him. I was like, oh, hey, how are you? You know, kind of whatever. And he was, I was like, oh, here's my number. Or he was like, oh, here's my number. Text me. And I told him off the bat. I was like, oh, I'm looking for a sugar daddy. He's like, okay, like, I've never done that before. But, like, let's talk more about it. So then he texts me. And then I think we had a few conversations. But I was in school at the time. I was way too busy. So I didn't talk to him for, like, two months. And then he texts me out of the blue. Hey, let's get dinner. Hey, like, uh, let me take you out for lunch. This and that, like. And then um, finally I was like, oh, yeah, like I'm looking for a sugar daddy. I do this much for a date. And then he's like, okay, call me. Let's talk more about it. And then that's when we moved it on to it. Okay, got it. Yeah, but Tinder's where it's at, girls. Like if you're looking to get like a sugar daddy, set your age gap all the way up (laughs) and then like swipe right and then just be like, hey, looking for a sugar daddy. Talk to them. Be nice. Don't like be too demanding, you know. All right. You're giving the girls some game on getting a sugar daddy. (laughs) Yeah. So, um. So we're going to kind of make this two questions then. Rafaela, have you ever had... Th- I said your name, right? Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Rafael, yeah. Have you ever had a sugar daddy? Mm, no. Okay. No. So have you ever been on a foodie call and have you ever had a sugar daddy? Um, I have been on a foodie call, but it was like a went to hang out with someone type of thing. Um, and sugar daddy, it was like in the progress of happening but it never happened because got scared of like actually going to meet this guy you got you got worried about meeting him yeah okay so but you had a prospect you had a sugar daddy prospect yeah okay and how did you meet him tinder um actually he reached out on instagram and 
He actually reached out to Gabby too. He he, reached out to we were gonna do it together. <laughs> <laughs> the double finesse. Yeah. Wait, do it he together. He wanted to hang out with both of us. Oh, at the same time. At the same yeah. time. Oh, so it was a sh- he wanted sugar. Yeah. Mm, no, he wanted to like talk well, and stuff. I feel like, like hang out. He, any so guy like they're angling. They want sex. Well, yeah, but they're not gonna say that. They don't want to scare us off. You yeah. know, they'll they'll still pay to take us out on the first date. I mean. <sighs> Guys, don't be fucking. Sh- come on, dude. Don't, <laughs> don't do Don't be that. these dudes. Don't do it. He offered don't us do it. money to I like hang know. out at the beach. <sighs> Bruv, was he, was he socially awkward? What no, was his thing? He, Good looking? Know. We FaceTimed him. How, how old was he? He was like 50. 50? <laughs> okay. Yeah. He was cool, but we were just scared to go like actually yeah. meet him. Guys, don't be don't be <laughs> fucking sugar daddies. Don't fucking don't you're I don't know if I can say simp because we're streaming on Twitch, but fuck it, whatever. Don't be a simp. Don't fucking guys, come on. I know I know I'm like y'all y'all trying to you know finesse, it, but come on guys, don't fucking simp. Um, okay, so he messaged you guys on Instagram. Yeah, yeah. And he wanted a threesome. No, well actually no. no he, he DM'd us like both individually i just and don't so, i don't get, okay, I don't get it. <laughs> no we were like talking about like our dms one day and i was like oh my god like this sugar daddy dm'd me she was, was like, like oh wait he dm'd me too yeah. and we we're like oh my god like he's just going around like ucsb girls i think and so we were like we told him we we're like oh like he was my best friend <laughs> <laughs> we were like down to hang out but it's scary yeah it, we were just always be scared, scared. <laughs> For your own safety, that's yeah. So, like, can go. Always bad. have a guy friend come and watch. And yeah. yeah. Somewhere actually, safe. We didn't even give him our number. We gave him like our friend's number. So yeah. that's smart. Would you do that just like on a regular date though? Like a guy you're actually interested in? Would you go on a date, but then like, there's a fucking guy friend in the corner or some shit? To me, that'd be f- kind of weird. A regular no, date? I wouldn't yeah. do. Like that. if I found okay. out, I'd be like, it's just kind of. Weird, like no. I, I, I mean, know. if it's a guy my own age, I would feel fine. Sure, 